Hello, everyone. Can you see and hear me? Subscribe. Okay, so you are able to see and hear me. So, bonjour and welcome everyone to the Hindu Editorial Analysis brought to you by An Academy and I am Vaishnavi Pandey, your English educator and the one who does the analysis. So, hello, hello everyone. 14th of August is today and we are going to be doing the analysis of today. Hi, Ritu. Hi, Christy. Hi, good news. Hi, Vedika. Bonjour. Uh, Kajal. Hi, Kajal. Thank you. Uh, Swati, good afternoon. Hivan, guten tag, Hivan. Somesh, hi. Mm -hmm. All right, so I believe I should start because I'm already late. Suhani, hi. Suhani. Dono bolu. <laughs> nice. Hi. Uchiha, <laughs> um, hello. Konnichiwa. <laughs> All right, so let's get started with our... Uh, editorial today lots of words today so it's better to get started asap hmm. all right this is my telegram channel if you have not subscribed to my channel yet please do do subscribe to my channel because all the happenings of my class and all the information and quizzes small little quizzes also so a lot of things happen on the channel so it is very 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 crucial that most crucial that you join the channel. So the name of the channel is Unacademy underscore Vashnavi underscore Clat. If you don't get this, you can scan this QR code and it will take you straight to my channel. All right, and this is me, by the way. All right, uh, if you have this newspaper analysis, ki, the Hindu editorial analysis, ki aapko PDF notes stay along with the annotations, then you can scan this QR code and June onwards, you will get the notes along with the annotation was reading this book the other day, the male protagonist, when uh, someone used to foul word around him, said only those people who cannot express themselves restore to such crude word in vocabulary. Uh, yes, Anushka, and there has been a lot of, I've read this in a lot of places, people who use profanity, people say that they are um, less creative with their words and such. Uh, such things are said but there are people who say that when uh, people use profanity it is those people who use profanity are uh, uh, better at or more resilient at pain and all that so there are different views about different people about using profanity and not using profanity so you believe in what you believe <laughs> whichever side you think is better you take that side <laughs> Hi, Shreya. Hi, Aman. Good afternoon. All right. Hmm. Ankita, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Ankita. All right. So let's get started uh, with the Next slide. That is the Wheel of Free English. At we have the editorial vocabulary quiz. Make sure that you all are present because this time I'm going to give uh, none of the words will be outside even the other options uh, that we will be taking. Taking Alpatia's advice and something uh, to make it more challenging. This time we are just going to use the words uh, even in uh, options that are not the correct answer we are going to use words from the from the editorial vocabulary all, all right so 
going to be challenging let's see how you fare in this one um now let's get started everyone let's get started everyone uh with the words let's get rolling hi apurva good afternoon and welcome all right so the first word that we have is reboot make awesome sentences guys good luck okay let's get started okay uh, reboot is our first word just ka matlab hota hai is a verb form which means to start something again or do something again in a way that is new and interesting okay so reboot karna kisi cheez ko we are not talking, uh, talking in context of computers right we are not talking in context of computers we are talking in con uh, in context of everything in general okay to agar koi cheez ko aap kisi cheez ko bolte hai, not computers other than computers you are talking about general scenario where you are talking about rebooting something is to start something again or do something again in a way that is new okay so do the same thing that has been done before but in a new way okay the same process you are following but in a new way okay you are adding something or you are making it interesting somehow okay so for example uh, let's say um we are uh, rebooting um, the jungle book okay the jungle book is being rebooted okay rebooted matlab ab the jungle book ka waise hi kahani to same rahega okay but it will be put in a new and interesting way all right so that is reboot is a verb form so you can use rebooting rebooted all of them uh then we have overhaul overhaul is a verb form again uh, so overhauled overhauling okay so com uh, to completely change something especially by getting rid of some people or things and replacing them with others okay so completely change something dekho ab uh, overhaul in general okay in general uh, matlab in context of ship and water agar hum ocean or sea or in sab ki baat kare तो बेसिकली फ्रॉम द शिप टू वॉटर ओके इज ओवरऑल बट हम उस सेंस में ऑब्वियसली वी आर नॉट टॉकिंग वी आर टॉकिंग इन द सेंस ऑफ लॉ वेन वी आर ओवर हॉलिंग अ लॉ और समथिंग अ पॉलिसी तो उसका मतलब होता है कंप्लीटली चेंज कर देना उसको उसको कंप्लीटली चेंज कर देना और किस तरह से चेंज करना बाय रिप्लेसिंग अ फ्यू पीपल और रिप्लेसिंग रिप्लेसिंग अ फ्यू थिंग्स ओके तो रीवैम्प करना इज लाइक ओवरऑल ओके सो कम्प्लीटली चेंज समथिंग एंड मेक इट न्यू एंड बाई चेंजिंग पीपल रिप्लेसिंग पीपल और थिंग्स इज ओवरऑल ओके नाउ द वर्ड ओवर ह्योर इज अब्रेस्ट ओके अब्रेस्ट इज द वर्ड विच इज एन एड वर्ब ओके बट ये कैसे यूज करते कीप अब्रेस्ट ऑफ समथिंग ओके वी यूज इट इन दिस वे ओके सो दिस इज न्यू और राइट दिस इज न्यू कीप अब्रेस्ट ऑफ समथिंग ओके कीप अब्रेस्ट ऑफ समथिंग इज टू मेक श्योर यू नो ऑल द मोस्ट रिसेंट फैक्ट्स अबाउट अ सब्जेक्ट और सिचुएशन ओके टू कीप अब्रेस्ट ऑफ समथिंग इज उससे रिलेटेड जो भी अपडेट्स आ रहे हैं ओके जो भी अपडेट्स आ रहे हैं आपको सारे कुछ पता है आपको सब कुछ पता है सो दैट इज कीप अब्रेस्ट ऑफ समथिंग ओके सो to make sure you know all the most recent fact about a subject or a situation okay so uh, um anmesh keeps abreast of all the nasa news okay or space craft news or space okay keep keeps abreast of space all right so that means uh, anmesh kya karta hai ev all the information related to space he make sure that he has recent facts and knows what is going on and everything okay then we have abstruse all right abstruse is an adjective which is again we will consider it as a new word abstruse ka matlab hota hai not known or understood by many people okay so this is situation is completely abstruse for me okay abstruse for me jaise agar koi uh, naya student aata hai and he has never attended this class before he uh, the student will be abstruse to what is happening in the class right in this editorial class ho kya chal kya raha hai okay so abstruse is not able to understand not know known by many people okay so people are abstruse of the um, uh, corruption going on in their own state okay so for example that could be a sentence on abstruse okay 
रीनेक्ट ओके नाउ नेक्स्ट वर्ड इज रीनेक्ट ये हमने पहले देख लिया है तो रीनेक्ट इज अगेन अ वर्ड व्हिच मींस टू रिपीट द एक्शन और एन इवेंट दैट हैपेंड इन द पास्ट एज अ हॉबी और एज अ परफॉर्मेंस ओके तो उसी चीज को रीनेक्ट करना ओके okay? कोई चीज को रीनेक्ट करना जो पहले हो चुका है कोई इवेंट पहले हो चुका है या कोई एक्शन पहले हो चुका है उसी को वापस से लाना ओके okay? उसी को वापस से लाना उसी को वापस से दिखाना इज रीनेक्ट ओके सो रीनेक्ट समथिंग इज टू डू समथिंग दैट हैपन बिफोर हैज हैपन बिफोर कोई भी इवेंट या परफॉर्मेंस उसको वापस से रिपीट कर देना ओके ओके नेक्स्ट वर्ड इज डी एंग्लिसाइजेशन ओके एंग्लिसाइजेशन एंग्लिसाइजेशन इज द वर्ड ओके अब जनरली डी एंग्लिसाइजेशन वॉज यूज इन दी आयरिश कॉन्सेप्ट बट यहां पर डी एंग्लिसाइजेशन मतलब क्या होता है एंग्लिसाइजेशन इज एंग्लो से आया ओके एंग्लो इज एनी थिंग दैट इज ब्रिटिश राइट सो कोई भी चीज uh, uh, जो ब्रिटिश से आई हुई होती है दैट इज कंसिडर्ड एज एंग्लो ओके एंग्लो तो उसके लिए एंग्लो प्रीफिक्स यूज करते हैं या रूट वर्ड यूज करते हैं सो डी एंग्लिसाइजेशन इज बेसिकली एलिमिनेटिंग द एलिमिनेशन ऑफ इंग्लिश इंफ्लुएंस उनका इंफ्लुएंस एलिमिनेट कर देना खत्म कर देना उनके लैंग्वेज को खत्म कर देना उनके कस्टम को खत्म कर देना कस्टम्स को खत्म कर देना इज डी एंग्लिसाइजेशन ऑल राइट ओके सो दैट इज अ न्यू वर्ड ओके देन वी हैव प्रिलिमिनरी प्रिलिमिनरी इज प्रिलिमिनरी प्रिलिमिनरी ओके इज अ नाउन जिसका मतलब होता है प्रिलिमिनरी भी हमने पहले देख लिया है आई थिंक सो ओके तो इसका मतलब होता है एन इवेंट और एक्शन दैट इंट्रोड्यूस और प्रिपेयर फॉर समथिंग एल्स ओके कोई भी चीज प्रिलिमिनरी होती है वो पहले आती है बिफोर द एक्चुअल इवेंट ओके या द मेन इवेंट या द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट या द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट बिट के पहले आती है दैट इज कॉल्ड प्रिलिमिनरी ओके सो प्रिलिमिनरी हियरिंग बहुत कॉमन यूजेज है इन सेंस ऑफ लॉ ओके then you have warrant another common word that is used excessively in terms of law and legal affairs to warrant a yahan par hum verb form use kar rahe okay warrant can be a noun form it can also be a verb form okay warrant is to justify or necessitate a course of action okay kisi course of action ya aap aap let's say aap bol rahe ho ki aapko ये किताब खरीदनी अपने पेरेंट्स को बोल रहे हो आपको ये किताब खरीदनी ओके नाउ यू हैव टू गिव अ वॉरेंट यू वॉरेंट द बुक एज टू वाई यू नीड इट ओके यू वॉरेंटेड द बुक एज टू वाई यू नीड इट मतलब आपने सफाई दिया आपने जस्टिफिकेशन दिया कि क्यों चाहिए आपको ये बुक ओके सो दैट इज बेसिकली अ वॉरेंट ओके सो यहाँ पर वर्क फॉर्म में यूज करेंगे जैसे वॉरेंटेड एंड वॉरेंटिंग ओके सो वर्क फॉर्म है यू कैन चेंज इट इन टू दी आई एन जी फॉर्म एंड बी ई डी फॉर्म एंड अगेन डिपेंड्स ऑन कैसे आप सेंटेंस में यूज कर रहे इट कैन बिकम अ नाउन और इट कैन बिकम अ वर्क सो सिनेम्स इसके होंगे विंडिकेट जस्टिफाई ओके विंडिकेट एंड जस्टिफाई आर दिनेम्स ऑल राइट दैट इज वॉरेंट जस्टिफाई और नेसेसिटेट कोर्स ऑफ एक्शन सिनेम हो गया विंडिकेट और जस्टिफाई ओके then we have a fresh a fresh is you know what is fresh okay so it's basically that okay so adverb form hai so um, we have to start a fresh okay we had to start a fresh so generally adverb form end mein lagta hai right kisi sentence ke end mein lagta hai so we have to start a fresh a fresh we had to start a new okay in a new or different way okay that is the meaning a fresh is to start something in a new or different way okay then we have consolation Consol if it is any consolation to you um i didn't let your glasses break ओके okay? अगर आप आपके फ्रेंड आपका आपका चश्मा और आपका फोन ले जाते हैं ओके okay? और आपकी स्कूटी ले जाते हैं या आपका बाइक ले जाते हैं और उसके बाद फिर दे मीट विथ विथ एन एक्सीडेंट जिसमें उनको तो कुछ नहीं होता है बट आपका फोन चकना चूर हो जाता है और आपका बाइक चकना चूर हो जाता है बट देन ही कम्स टू यू एंड ही सेज दैट सॉरी यार एक्सीडेंट हो गया था तो सब कुछ टूटा गया बट इफ इट इज एनी कॉन्सुलेशन फॉर यू योर स्पेक्स आर ऑल राइट ओके आपका शेड आर ऑल राइट या आपका चश्मा इज ऑल राइट ओके सो कॉन्सुलेशन इज द the comfort 
received by a person after a loss or disappointment okay koi loss or disappointment experience karne ke baad okay koi bada chot khane ke baad aapko thodi si thoda sa comfort provide hota hai that is consolation okay so consolation is after a huge loss or disappointment aapko kuch uh, you have consolation prizes as well yahi example pichle baar diya tha maine all right so the words that we saw are uh, re reboot overhaul keep abreast of something abstruse reenact deanglicization preliminary warrant fresh and consolation all right uchi i still don't think you have rebooted yourself mm hmm let's comments ओके अमन मैम आप लोग जो आप नो अमन ऐसा नहीं है यूट्यूब पे डिफरेंट सेट ऑफ सेशन होता है ओके डिफरेंट सेट ऑफ सेशन होता है एंड यूट्यूब इज ऑलवेज ऑन अ लाइटर नोट ओके जो जो कॉन्सेंट्रेटेड और टारगेटेड पढ़ाई करते हैं हम वो वो हम ऐप पे करते हैं प्लेटफॉर्म पे करते हैं ऑल राइट let's crack it good afternoon harshika good afternoon after my break up with my girlfriend i rebooted my way of living very nice uche i really hope that you do anushka good afternoon i wish that i could reboot my life very nice shreya good job good job uh somesh i rebooted my work when my relatives child spoil my project very nice very nice somesh anushka the supreme court reboots its discussion over the implementation of the uniform civil code across the country very nice anushka very nice good job sanjana hi good afternoon christy uh, he want to re reboot our relation but sorry babe i need to overhaul my life by replacing you very nice uh good job christy which yeah, i rebooted my way of living by overhauling my girlfriend <laughs> okay which yeah, are two sentences on rebooting and girlfriend and breaking up <laughs> but good okay sohani amit shah overhaul the criminal law overhauls the criminal law okay if you're talking about a present sentence okay simple present me use karenge तो अमित शाह ओवर हॉल्ड या तो आप यूज कर सकते हैं अगर आपको पास में या अगर प्रेजेंट में यूज करना है तो ओवर हॉल्स द क्रिमिनल लॉ ओके सुहानी गुड जॉब श्रेया आई ओवर हॉल्ड ऑल ऑफ माय फेक फ्रेंड्स ऑन माय बर्थडे वेरी नाइस श्रेया गुड जॉब गुरनूर आई वांटेड टू कवर I wanted to cover the conversation in a different manner, but but that but is not the same but as the but in conjunction. <laughs> it was going on another way it, it was going in another way so i rebooted the conversation very nice gurnoor good job i get upset you seeing marks in rc but seeing ma'am's analysis technique i try to reboot where i made mistake bravo bravo apurva good job good job uh, apurva isse zyada aapko kuch karna bhi nahi hai kuch nahi karna isse zyada <laughs> अंकिता लोकसभा ओवरहॉल द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ नेशनल कैपिटल टेरिटरी ऑफ डेली बिल ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन वेरी नाइस अंकिता गुड जॉब क्रिस्टी बिफोर इंटरवीनिंग इन आर मैटर in our matters keep abreast of all info whose fault as to whose fault it is okay very nice christy good job i always keep abreast of on my of my friends relationship okay i always keep abreast of something okay of something okay Vedika, our company is going to reboot the policies after the trial uh, is done uh, to see if it is worthy. Very nice, Vedika. Good job. Good job, sweetheart. Good job. Ankita, I rebooted my CLAT preparation to score better. Very nice, Ankita. Good job. Our new parliament is completely overall. Very nice, Vedika. Good job. 
Palak bypassing the hi Palak bypassing the new data protection bill in the parliament. Many questions arise uh, uh, arise about arose arose about the uh, abstruse faced by the opposition. Very nice, very nice Palak. Mazaga, good job. I don't want to reenact my mistakes. Very nice, good note. Good job. You shouldn't. Then it would be, if you reenact your mistakes, then it would uh, not be a mistake. It would be a stupidity. Okay. Uh, Vedika, good sentence. Good note. Vedika, we should keep abreast of current issues so to excel in CA section. Very nice, Vedika. Good job. Someone uh, should come forward and overhaul the patriarchy system we face in India. Very nice, Palla. Good job. Anushka, it is so exhausting to keep abreast of all the minor points in current affairs that may be abstruse to other people. Very nice, Anushka. Good job. Uh, Ankita, I used to... Re I used to... I used... I used to reenact my brother's brother's apostrophe S work for fun. Very nice, Ankita. Good job. Christy, our business deal is abstruse. That's why I want to sell my share shares now. Very nice, Christy. Good job. Shreya, I, I want to reenact my childhood memories. Very nice, Shreya. Good job. Anushka, district magistrate reenacted section 144. Very nice, Anushka. Palak, my mother tried to reboot the mop machine after its pouch bag got stuck. Very nice, Palak. Good job. Vedika, Sanskrit language is something that is still abstruse among people that it is... Uh, is so abstruse among people that so abstruse that okay that it is the only language because of which other language uh, languages have been uh, formed uh, sanskrit is a language um that has emerged from uh, from which other languages have emerged and people are abstruse about it okay so uh, sentence structuring thoda sa change karna hoga vedika uh, good job though hindi is a language which uh, you can never de-anglicize de-anglicize okay hindi is a language which you can never de-anglicize okay matlab usme se english ka effect aap hata nahi sakte hmm. or okay uh even my mustang needs a complete overhaul uh or else it it's gonna blow due to overpower it's gonna blow up due to Overpower. Very nice. Oh my god. <laughs> Good job. Bhai, what, a, what an abstruse mock it was. Wow. Very nice, Shreya. Good job. I'm enjoying my life in a in an a fresh way. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. Uchiya. Good job. Our school reenacted the life of Anne Frank. Very nice, Vedika. Good job. Palak, uh, BJP always de-anglicized in amendment of laws by changing their names. Has always, okay, has always. BJP has always de-anglicized uh, amendments, okay, not in amendments, and de-anglicized amendments of law, uh, amendments of law by changing their names. Very nice, Palak, good job. Bonjour, Piyush, bonjour. Kama sava? Sava bien? <laughs> uh start afresh yes for non uh, cognizable offenses the police must have a warrant to arrest the wrongdoers here she has made it with a noun form okay uh, christy always start afresh after getting failures but never lose l o s e hoga okay not l o o s e okay never lose your hope it is the key of success key to success very nice christy good job apura whenever i go what is the problem with people wherever i go i don't know what is the problem with people when they are not able to abstruse then why do they say now the neighbors aren't is saying why do they 
say anything okay why do they say anything now the neighbor aunt's is a neighbor's aunt um neighbor's aunt is saying that with whom yesterday with you with you when her son was mm -mm -mm. last line apurva reenacted palak good uh, sorry um, but apurva i understood what you are trying to say so frame it in a better way and i know you can do it palak she warranted her ill action by playing victim card even though it was uh, the victim there i was the victim there very nice very nice palak good job uh Vedika, try to afresh your way of studying that is more suitable and perfect for your preparation. Very nice, Vedika. Hivan, my 1969 Mustang black badge was an abstruse for many people until they got to know how I drive it. Whoa, very nice. Vedika, people try to consolidate the family in which death has taken place. Very nice, Vedika. Good job. uh people try to con con console okay not consolidate okay console the family not consolidate consolidate is to pile something up together okay some information some bits of information okay so console the family in which uh, death has taken place very nice vedika christy after one slap and denied for my after a slap and a denial for my goa trip my mother provided consolation um, consolation but still my thinking about but still i'm thinking about goa very nice uh, shreya after his preliminary research the student could tell he was going to have a hard time with his team paper with his term paper very nice very nice shreya good job but like after giving tomorrow's mock i started to console myself that agar clat nahi hua to momos ki dukaan to khul hi <laughs> good job good job palak <laughs> optimistic people you see <laughs> uh, i wish the 90s era of hindi song uh, will reboot again very nice ritu good job they try to reboot it every now and then uh good job piyush the only problem is after not getting desired marks in my mocks i have to reboot myself for next uh, next try next try not better try next try uchi i wanted to sign the death warrant of jaffrey jaffrey l damer oh, the damer case whose imprisonment was for 947 years yes i saw that i try to breast every possible thing very nice ankita good job simple as that after troubling me when my friend comes to ask what happened then i feel like killing him uh, when only cons consolation consolation is to be done then why does he do this uh when only consolation has to be done uh, uh, then why does he have to do this very nice uh, apurva understood uh, good job hivan the fbi has a search warrant to search my house but i got the information the day before yesterday <laughs> from the director of fbi uh shifted everything to my warehouse Uh, all all lakshman's uh, dialogue is simply this <laughs> is a dab <laughs> uh very nice uh uchiha if only i was born uh at the time of dharma good job uh uchiha uh piyush when i i broke up okay when i not broke up when i broke up with my girlfriend i did a massive overhaul of my entire apartment and threw away everything that reminded me of my ex very nice piyush good job i want to reenact law for women benefit for the benefit of women like in ancient time they were getting okay very nice christy i overhaul my brother's thought only by my speech but still he reenacted his horrible thoughts very nice apurva earlier my best friend used to tease me now he has become my boyfriend so he has adopted a fresh way to tease me <laughs> 
but where is the word? Okay, again, you can fake happiness, sadness, humbleness or any other emotion, but pain is real and nobody can uh, afresh that. And I love that. Very nice. Hey, one good job. I need to afresh my work in order to impress my teacher. Uh, good job, Sanjana. When I had a bad day and tentative scores in mock, my boyfriend. Okay, you cannot have tentative scores in mocks. Okay, tentative scores would be approximate scores. Okay, so uh, bad scores. Okay, bad day and bad scores in my mock. My boyfriend consoled me. Past ki baat hori, consoled me by rebooting uh, me. Why I started this by reminding me. As to why I started this journey, and that was a reboot for me. Okay, Sanjana, good job. You getting to the preliminary round of the playoffs is good, but all the way to the championship is even better. Very nice. In the backdrop of Manipur violence, new laws are going to be enacted. Very nice. But the sole problem is the habit of BJP playing dirty politics and warranting its action. Very nice, Palak. You have used the word warranting as a verb. Only you and you alone have done that. Very nice. I also have a cutter, just like you and Lawrence. Very nice. Good job. <laughs> Bala, at least Piyush had uh, someone to overall with me memories of her. Very nice, Bala. Good job. I appreciate those people who afresh themselves by hard times. Okay, next set of words. Uh, there is... There are little more words after this as well. So let's start with a new set of words. If anyone needs a warrant, then come to me. I will definitely help. <laughs> that court order uh, ordered a warrant for the arrest of the perpetrator. Okay, good job. I'll refresh my studies by in a different way. Very nice, Shreya. Okay, good job. I need a fresh... I don't know, Gurnoor, you started off uh, on the thing, but uh, after that, why is it not letting you make sentence? I don't know. Okay, next word. Okay, next word is scrutinize. We have a lot of scrutinize. Scrutinize is a verb which means to examine or inspect closely and thoroughly. Okay, scrutinize means to examine or examine or inspect or examine or inspect or inspect. नजदीकी और बारीकी से, ओके? नजदीकी और बारीकी से किसी चीज को एग्जामिन या इंस्पेक्ट करना इस तू स्क्रूटनाइज, ओके? स्क्रूटनाइज समथिंग। देन वी हैव ओवरहॉल। सॉरी, गो ओवरबोर्ड, ओके? नाउ ओवरबोर्ड ओके, गो ओवरबोर्ड। जिसका मतलब होता है टू डू समथिंग टू मच। or to be <laughs> or to be YouTube could be dar lagta hai ki aap uh, khatarnaak sentences bana doge Gurnoor that is the problem <laughs> dar gaya hai YouTube aap se <laughs> to do something too much okay go overboard is um, so I went overboard with their wedding decoration or wedding planning I went overboard with my best friend's uh, prep, uh, preparation for the future. I went overboard in um, buying things for my husband or something. Okay, so go overboard about something is to do excess. Okay, so generally a problem of perfectionist. Okay, yeah, people who are theatrical, they like to, you know, um, do th something too much. <laughs> Go overboard, okay, is an idiomatic expression, all right? Yeah, yeah, words ke se aapko aap se chal rahe YouTube. <laughs> Monica, oh my darling. At least Piyush had someone to overall her okay, choice. <laughs> what an abstruse girl she is, and surprisingly, she's my girl. <laughs> Um, 
प्रेलिमिनरी मतलब हुआ अंकिता की जो कोई इम्पोर्टेंट इवेंट जैसे शुरू होने वाला है ओके okay? कोई भी इम्पोर्टेंट चीज शुरू होने वाला है उससे पहले जो उसका इंट्रोडक्शन या उससे पहले जो चीजें की जाती है उसको प्रेलिमिनरी कहते हैं ओके सो द स्टार्ट ऑफ समथिंग बिग उसका स्टार्ट को हम कहते हैं प्रेलिमिनरी ओके सो प्रेलिमिनरी हियरिंग इज द स्टार्टिंग ऑफ द हियरिंग ओके टू गो ओवर बोर्ड इज टू डू समथिंग टू मच और टू बी टू एक्साइटेड और ईगर अबाउट समथिंग ओके सो यू योर 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 बेस्ट फ्रेंड गॉट अ ग्रेट जॉब लाइक अ जॉब दैट शी हैड नेवर ड्रेम्ड ऑफ सो you got uh, you went overboard with her with the news okay you went overboard with the news matlab aap kuch zyada excited ho gaye us news ko sunke okay secessionist okay secessionist uh, secessionist secessionism uh, okay secessionism 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 okay secessionism yahan par use kiya gaya hai passage mein to main pehle bataungi secessionist kya hota hai ist jab bhi suffix use hota hai to it is used for a type of person right so secession jo secession karta hai unko kehte hain secessionist okay ab secession kya hota hai okay रिलेटिंग टू और सपोर्टिंग सिसेशन ओके सो सिसेशन सपोर्ट जो करते हैं उनको कहते हैं सिसेशनिस्ट और सिसेशन क्या होता है सिसेशन द एक्ट ऑफ बिकमिंग इंडिपेंडेंट the act of becoming independent and no longer part of a country okay independent ho jana kisi country ya organization ya area ka part nahi rehna okay to alag hone ki jo bhavna rakhte hain okay alag hone ki jo bhavna rakhte hain unko kya kehte hain secessionist okay and secessionism is jo uh, is the process of secession okay or uh, going with secession okay uh, people who prefer know my mom nishita hi nishita i'm sorry i couldn't reply to you sweetheart yesterday i i wanted to reply uh, but then i forgot because there were other messages i'm so sorry i'm going to reply to you nishita you you are not forgotten don't you worry sweet, sweetheart are you the same nishita by the way if not then i am uh, ranting all this for no reason <laughs> but if you are hearing this nishita i'm going to respond to you <laughs> all right <laughs> oh shreya when it's vashnavi ma'am's editorial session i go overboard <laughs> very nice shreya good job nice sentence but surprisingly aapne uh, vashnavi ko capital nahi kiya lekin ma'am ko aapne capital kiya <laughs> shreya shreya sweetheart <laughs> same nishita okay all right ओके देन वी हैव सबवर्सिव ओके सबवर्ड सबवर्सिव एडजेक्टिव फॉर्म है उसका सबवर्सिव ओके सो लेट्स कंसिडर दिस एज न्यू वर्ड ट्राइंग टू डिस्ट्रॉय और डैमेज समथिंग स्पेशली एन एस्टैब्लिश्ड पॉलिटिकल सिस्टम ओके सबवर्ड करना या सबवर्सिव बिहेवियर दिखाना मतलब क्या करना कि किस चीज की कोशिश करना जो कोई इस्टेब्लिश पोलिटिकल सिस्टम है उसको क्या करना ट्राई ट्राई सॉरी डिबेस समथिंग ओके अ पॉलिटिकल सिस्टम या जो ऑलरेडी सिस्टम है उसको क्या करना ट्राई उसको हानि पहुंचाना डैमेज पहुंचाना या उसे uh, उसे बर्बाद करने की कोशिश करना इज सबर्जन ओके दैट इज एडजेक्टिव फॉर्म ओके सो सबवर्ड से आया सबवर्जन ओके सबवर्ड इज द वर्ब फॉर्म Someone was asking me the meaning of subvert a few days back. In danger, in danger, भी हमने पहले कर लिया है. Okay, in danger करना मतलब to put someone or something at risk or in danger of being harmed, damaged or destroyed. Okay, in danger करना मतलब to put something or uh, to put someone or something at risk or in danger of being harmed, damaged or destroyed. Okay, that is to in danger. Okay, किसी को ऐसे 
ऐसे पोजीशन में रखना ओके या ऐसे सिचुएशन में डाल देना जो बहुत रिस्की सिचुएशन है जिससे उन्हें हानि पहुंच सकती है या डैमेज पहुंच सकता है या डिस्ट्रॉय हो सकता है वो चीज ओके सो ऐसे सिचुएशन में रखना इज टू इन डेंजर ऑल राइट देन वी हैव jeopardize okay jeopardize now i would request all of you to uh, i forgot to uh, tell this to you uh, and i forget very often to like the video as well as uh, along with the subscription i'm sure you have taken the subscription of an academy clat but please make sure that you like every video as well that would be great for me <laughs> so i beg thee <laughs> to like the <laughs> videos all right jeopardize and now jeopardize is a, a, again a word that we have seen before putting something in jeopardy okay jeopardy and jeopardize okay jeopardy is to is the noun form okay uh, um and jeopardize something is the verb form okay so uh, jeopardy is at a uh, being in a risk factor okay being at risk of something and um, jeopardy in danger are almost similar theek hai dono synonymous type ke words hain jeopardize ka matlab kya hota hai to put something such as a plan or a system in danger of being harmed or damaged dekho yahan par bhi in danger ka matlab kya hota hai to put someone or something at risk or in danger of being harmed or damaged or destroyed okay subversive kya hota hai trying to destroy or damage something okay so the, the three words if you see subversive in danger and jeopardize sort of falling in place okay uh, almost in the same cluster in and especially in danger and jeopardize all right uh, then we have lynching mob lynching humne dekha hai to mob lynching is the act of killing someone without legal trial kisi ko aap maar dete hain aap nahi matlab kisi ko agar koi maar deta hai without public trial or, sorry without legal trial okay matlab usme koi uske upar koi kanuni karwai nahi kara ke okay ulta usko bas doshi uh, karar de ke aap unko kya kar dete ho मार देते हैं ओके सो दैट इज लिंचिंग अब मॉब लिंचिंग इज बहुत सारे लोग मिलके मार देते हैं ओके किसी को द एक्ट ऑफ किलिंग समवन विदाउट अ लीगल ट्रायल यूजुअली बाय हैंगिंग ओके इज लिंचिंग और ये वर्ड भी हमने पहले कर लिया ओके I looked everywhere and after scrutinizing, I came to know that if I want peace, then I should go to Kedarnath or Banaras. <laughs> very nice, very nice, Apurva. Good job, uh, Uchiha. Because of their Bishnoi gang past crimes, everything uh, they do now will be subjected to. यस गुरनूर देख रही हूँ विल बी सब्जेक्टेड टू स्क्रूटनी वेदिका माई मॉम गेट्स ओवर बोर्ड एट द टाइम ऑफ शॉपिंग वेरी नाइस वेदिका या आई थिंक ऑल ऑफ आस गो अलिटल ओवर बोर्ड एट द टाइम ऑफ शॉपिंग आस्था she went overboard with the decorations very nice aasta good job so mesh when i joined the uh, the raw hq <laughs> quarters location nahi bataunga ooh <laughs> the functionality and technical uh, technicality there seems abstruse to me uh, seemed abstruse to me then uh, the senior officer advised me to keep abreast of all things happening there very nice somesh good job good good boys one girls don't like uh, go overboard uh, type of people uh boys one girls don't like to go over, uh, with um, over both type of people very much so be careful okay very nice nishita christy i went over board for correct option still i scored less than even less than ever and decided to scrutinize my mock very nice christy that's a very wise decision i'm asking hmm 
उचिया ये तो मुझे पता ही नहीं था अंश आपका रियल नेम थैंक यू नाउ आई नो श्रेया वेन ओके ये मैंने पढ़ लिया बार बार अपनी पढ़ा नहीं पढ़ूंगी बट श्रेया थैंक यू नो निश्चिता इट डज नॉट हैपन डज नॉट हैपन विथ मी बट आई डोंट नो वाई इट इज हैपनिंग ओनली वेन इट कम्स टू यू आई डोंट नो आई एम सॉरी स्वीराट नॉट माई इंटेंशन ओके Before you purchase an expensive item, make sure you scrutinize it for any defects. Very nice, Piyush. Good job, Sanjana. I always get overboard when my sister purchases any new dress for me. Very nice, Sanjana. Good job. The secessionist element was voluntarily or per force excluded. Okay, अब गुरनूर का sentence पढ़ लेते हैं नहीं तो good. <laughs> अकेले टेलीग्राम पे चलाएगा आई विश यू वर माई इंग्लिश असाइनमेंट सो दैट आई कुड गो ओवर बोर्ड पाओ गुरनूर यस नाउ आई नो दी एक्साइटमेंट वाई यू वॉन्ट मी टू सी इट Got it. Okay, one sentence. Good <laughs> Good job, though. Good job. Uh, he engaged in subversive activities. Asta, good job. Palak, mob lynching has jeopardized Muslim communities in India, as many Hindus have have gone overboard about uh, Akhand Bharat. Very nice, Palak. Good job. Brilliant sentence. Uh, so, Mish, whenever my mum says uh, says me to bring, asks me to bring samosas instead of her. instead of it i bring poha instead of her poha i go overboard very nice somesh good job um <clears throat> no one tells about their relationship and everyone gets overboard to know about my re- relationship when they know that i will not tell anything about my ex and boyfriend <laughs> okay शेयरिंग इज केयरिंग आई वॉज मेकिंग सेंटेंस ऑन माई गर्ल फ्रेंड ओलियर सो यू कैन इजिली नो ओके आई होल्ड माई ममाज आई होल्ड माई ममा जस्ट टू कुक अ सिंपल मील बट शी वेंट ओवर बोर्ड आई वॉन्ट आई वॉन्टेड माई मम टू और ममा टू मेक to cook simple meal but she uh, com- she went completely overboard uh <laughs> you sh- ye detail this is too much information peers tmi tmi peers tmi <laughs> okay you went overboard with the sentence <laughs> apurva people of parliament be careful because i am also coming if you can save the parliament from being subversive then then save it because i am future lady vidhayak yay apurva hud da bang da bang anushka she scrutinized him uh, from head to toe from side of her eyes while pretending to read a book while he was working out looking like a geek god greek god only to realize that she was reading the book upside <laughs> ooh anushka good job mm mm-hmm. christy uh, he put me in in danger he endangered me not put me in danger okay put, he endangered me after after my after our breakup i am still there with his memory i hi christy dukh to hota hai i blackmail my mother that i'll become a secessionist if she does make my favorite dishes very nice very nice only for fun because as a kuch to flying chapel receive hogi yes <laughs> i know all the guts come here <laughs> uh manipur in common with north eastern state had trouble uh, secessionist group okay i went overboard while watching anime and watch 700 episodes of it in a week i do that too once sometimes uh sometimes with books sometimes with anime sometimes with tv series that happens with me a lot as well 
I go overboard with a lot of things. Uh, nice sentence. So, uh, he pleaded not guilty to recklessly endangering public safety. Very nice, Astha. Good job. After stealing the ice cream from the uh, from the fridge, my brother puts me in an endangered position, whereas I only opened the fridge. And he ate the whole ice cream. Okay. Apurva corrections. Jaise jaise bataya kar lena. Okay. Dhyan dena. Hmm. Lord Garu. Uh, Ma'am, agar main aad se preparation shuru karu, to mera ho sakta hai clear clear. Ye main nahi bata sakti ho aapko. I, you will be a better judge of it. Aap syllabus dekho. Aap apna potential dekho. Uske baad aap decide karo. That would be the most honest decision of your life. Aaj main bol dungi ki, ki nahi nahi ho jayega, ekdam ho jayega. I don't want to mislead you, okay? So, please make sure that you realize your potential and kitna aapko effort lagana hai. Aap laga sakte itne din mein utna effort to badiya hai, to aap ho jayega, nahi laga sakte ho, to nahi ho paega, okay? So, you decide. You will be the better judge of it. Ritu, I need to scrutinize my work because it shows my overboard feeling and it may endanger my career. Very nice, uh, Ritu. Good job. I go overboard uh, with maths, okay? Asta, I go overboard with maths, okay? Um, Anj. Anj, ek to itne saare sentence. Upar se aap aur bhi question pad rahe ho aap aur bhi logo se conversation karo bas sentence banao please abhi thodi der ke liye and then once i go to the promotion page you can have a conversation artist ki khoj rahe ho bhai yaar uh sanjana i put my brother in endanger uh, when i have dekho you don't put someone in endanger you endanger them ye verb form hai to is isko verb ki tarah use karna hai right ye ishq hai i'm feeling I am feeling being ignored. No, Gurnoor. You, I am feeling that I am being ignored. Okay. By the way, so you are not. This proves that you are not. <laughs> if you uh, do not follow the safety instruction, you will jeopardize your health. Very nice, Piyush. Because my parents do did not allow my Goa trip, I decided to secession, uh, secession myself from my family. Okay. Secession myself from my family. All right. All right, uh, it is better to marry someone than to jeopardize someone's life. Both together ruin each other's life and I will watch everything from a distance. <laughs> okay. All right, so we don't have that much time that I could read. Why not reading my sentence? I read Christy, but I don't have... Okay, leaving... Me with my relatives is jeopardize is uh is a jeopardized crime, mama, mama, which you both have done or have committed. Okay, good job. I always go overboard uh when it comes to aaj kafi words the. Yes, good noor. I know. Uh. I always go overboard when it comes to shopping for cars and sneakers. Yeah, yeah, cars and sneakers. <laughs> and with the hood. <laughs> and games as well. I think, Yvonne, you go overboard with games as well. Don't think I have not noticed those dark circles. I know what you've been doing, Yvonne. You've been playing excessively. All right. Next is proclaim. Proclaim ka matlab kya hota hai? Proclaim karna matlab announce kar dena. Publicly announce kar dena. Okay. Aaj se the Hindu editorial mein daily aunga ya aungi. This was proclaimed by all my students. Aaj se we will make sure that we like every Hindu editorial analysis by Vaishnavi ma'am. This was proclaimed by my students. <laughs> All right. To announce something publicly or officially, especially something positive. All right. So proclaim karna, especially something positive. Don't do that, Gurnoor. Aise nahi karte. Is class mein nahi karo. Already we are running short of time. Uh, in absentia. Okay. Ad, uh, adverb form hai. Okay, while not present at event being referred to. Okay, ye naya word hai hamare paas. 
कोई नहीं कोई नहीं कोई नहीं I can understand your situation as well. You are the only one talking on Telegram. I know, and everyone is here, so I feel bad for you too. Here, uh, sorry, good news. Why am I saying here one? Padle bhai, then it's over. Okay, in absentia, in absentia is while not present at an event being referred to. जिस event के बारे में बात हो रही है, you were in absentia. इन दैट इवेंट ओके यू वर इन एबसेंशिया मतलब आप उस इवेंट से एबसेंट थे ओके इन एबसेंशिया इज एट वर्क फॉर्म जनरली इट विल ऑल्सो बी यूज इन दी एंड ओके ओके देन डीम ओके डीम्ड फिट जनरली हम क्या बोलते हैं वॉट इज द वर्ड दैट वी यूज डीम्ड fit okay so he was deemed unfit or he was deemed fit to play the match okay he was deemed unfit or he was deemed fit that means he was regarded or considered fit or unfit for a spec in a specific way okay uh now not necessary ki aap fit ke sath hi use karna hai ise but deemed matlab consider ya regarded okay and finally we have seizure ye wo wala seizure nahi hai jo jisme insaan uh starts shaking uh Vigorously, that is a different seizure. ये seizure मतलब seize कर लेना, okay? Seize कर लेना, okay? Seize कर लेने से seizure आया है, okay? Verb form है. All right. So this is again we'll consider this as a new word. The action of capturing someone or something using force, okay? To seize the moment, okay? Um. Viru proclaimed proclaimed his love for Basanti. <laughs> wow, Ritu. <laughs> he proclaimed that he will run for. Proclaimed. Sab ed form kyun nahi use kar rahe ho? Aap past form jaisi banate ho, verb hai to aap ed form use karo. Okay. There are so many uh, deemed to be law during the date of the case. Okay. What? What? Unfortunately, my client was in absentia during the date of the case. Very nice, Vedika. Good job. See that. Uh, Shreya, there are so many deemed to be law universities in India. Very nice. Okay. So, Mesh, in zombie apocalypse in my school, in a zombie apocalypse in my school, I scrutinized the situation and took one of the officer's gun and then I started to help everyone to escape or... Hide like a hero. Okay, then my lucid dream broke, broke, not broke, broke. Yeah, the fantastic sentence, fantastic song, so much. But yeah, good job. State official proclaimed that the sexual harassment allegations, uh, faced by BJP minister are deemed false. Very nice, Pala. Good job for taking divorce in Muslim law. The husband has to proclaim publicly. That he wants to take divorce. Very nice, Shreya. Good job. Good job. Good job, Anushka. The day I upload my picture with my NLU in the background, that is going to proclaim something very crucial without even me uttering a single word. Yeah, that you made it, girl. Yes, Anushka. That will be the day. Um, and when I proclaim to marry my advocate friend, my ex got vexed. Okay. The changes made in the judicial system have been proclaimed by Amit Shah yesterday on all uh, news channel. Very nice, Vedika. Okay, good job. Good noon message tele group pe kar. <laughs> but usko reply class me me mil raha. <laughs> yes, because I don't want him to stop coming to the classes just because uh, yahan par uh, he's not able to write. But he's such a sweetheart. He's still messaging over there. I feel bad. Anyway, all India CLAT mock test 2024 is a pack of 35. Just me, I got 30 full length CLAT ke mock tests milte, five full length elite ke mock tests milte, and this is exclusively available on the An Academy store at a discounted price of 3,360. CLAT ke printed mocks, just me, 10 section of mocks, 10 full length mocks that will be based on the new pattern will be delivered right at your doorstep, and this is available with all iconic and 12 months and above plus subscription. 
experience the actual CLAT before the exam, uh, you have an opportunity of attending offline mock at CLAT uh, at our Run Academy CLAT Center in our Delhi and Punika Center on the 27th August, 10th September and 24th September. So enroll now. The Warriors is the badge for CLAT, ELIT, MHCT, LSAT, SLAT 2024. You can use my code VASHNAVI10 to get flat 5% off on your Un Academy subscription. <laughs> <laughs> Good, no, I remember that. <laughs> okay, and I'm taking English language in this batch. Clad ke subscription ke benefits kya kya hai? Plus, do tarah ke su subscription hai. Plus subscription hai, iconic subscri subscription hai. Plus subscription is a basic plan, just mein daily life classes milte, life structured uh, tests and quizzes milte, structured courses milte, access to e-notes milte. Yeh sara kuch milte, aapko iconic mein live mentoring sessions milte, detailed physical notes that will be delivered right at your doorstep, printed full length mock tests that will be delivered right at your doorstep, and you will be able to attend offline mock test at our Run Academy Center. These are the benefits. Let's get started. The one who wants to stay with me, they uh, they do not make me make an excuse. And the ones who want to go can go. I will not seize anyone. Okay, I will not seize anyone. All right. Pens and highlighters out, everyone. Pens and highlighters out. Out, out, out. Let's get started. Rebooting the codes. Okay, rebooting the codes. <laughs> so, Mish, idhar 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 so Mish. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Now we see the conclusion. Kya hai? Criminal laws may need reform, but not new and unfamiliar names. Okay. So, author ka kehna hai ki zaruri ho sakta reform, lekin reform aisa reform nahi chahiye, jisme naye or unfamiliar names aare. Okay. Aise reforms nahi chahiye. Okay. So this becomes the conclusion. Okay. This becomes the conclusion of today. All right. Let's start. Few would disagree that law, laws require an overall from time to time so that uh, they could be abreast of development in technology and changes in society. So few would disagree, okay? Few would disagree. Matlab koi disagree nahi karega is cheez se, okay? Few matlab close to zero hota, okay? This word means close to zero, okay? A few rehta to kuch aur baat hoti, okay? Yahan par few use kiya gaya, okay? Few would disagree that laws require an overhaul from... So laws ko change karne ki zorat hoti hai completely from time to time, okay? Taaki wo development or technology ke saath saath chalte rahe society mein, okay? So this is what the main idea is not the complete main idea uske baap dekhte however okay however it does not mean that whole new codes be introduced and given abstruse names when in uh, in substance the old laws are essentially retained okay so ye to sab manenge okay the author has given a general statement sabse pehle ki sab manenge ye baat ki yes laws ko beech beech mein change aur unko zamane ke hisab se badalte rehna chahiye okay lekin ye ko ye jo lekin iska ye matlab nahi hota hai ki pura code codes hi change kar do aap new codes introduce kar do aap aur uske baad usko aise aise naam do abstruse naam jisko pata hi nahi hai kisi ko in namon ke bare mein okay और सब्सटेंस में और वो एक्चुअली क्या है उस उनके अगर ये जो नए नाम से ये जो नए कोड्स आ रहे हैं ओके अगर इनको एक्चुअल में देखो तो वो एसेंशियली पहले ही वाले जैसे लॉ हैं ओके तो आप बस नाम चेंज कर रहे हो लॉ वापस से वही है ओके तो नाम चेंज कर रहे हो और नाम ऐसा चेंज कर दे रहे हो जिसको जिसके बारे में किसी को पता ही नहीं है ओके सो दैट इज समथिंग दैट दी ऑथर हैज अ प्रॉब्लम विद ओके दैट यस लॉज नीड टू बी चेंज्ड एंड they need to be overhauled from time to time. Lekin they certainly do not need to be named with abstruse names. And uh, where the laws remain the same, just the names are changing. Okay. Uh, all right. देखते हैं इसी के बारे में फर्दर एक्सप्लेन करेगा यहां से यहां तक मेन आइडिया हो जाता है फर्दर एक्सप्लेन कर रहा ऑथर द फर्स्ट क्रिटिसिज्म अबाउट द भारतीय न्याय 
Sanhita, uh, B and S to replace criminal, uh, uh, to replace the Indian Penal Code, the Bharatiya Nagrik Suraksha Sanhita, uh, San, uh, B and S S to replace the Code of Criminal Procedure and Bharatiya Saksha Bill to replace the Indian Evidence Act is that it is unnecessary to refer to them wholly in their Hindi names. Okay. So, this explanation, this general explanation, the author has given an example that the first criticism they have faced, the BNS, BNSS, and the BSB, okay, Bharatiya. सक्षम बिल ओके ये तीनों जो नाम दिए गए हैं ये तीनों नाम रिप्लेस करने वाले हैं ये 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 कोड्स को जो जो पहले इनका नाम था ओके जैसे इनको इंडियन पीनल कोड को अब बीएनएस ओके कोड ऑफ क्रिमिनल प्रोसीजर को बीएनएसएस ओके और दिस इज़ द एग्जांपल ओके दैट द ऑथर इज़ गिवन ओके सो यू जस्ट हैव टू स्किम थ्रू दिस ओके एवरी लॉ इन इंडिया हैज एन ऑफिशियल ट्रांसलेशन अब इसी को फर्दर एक्सप्लेन कर रहा है ऑथर ओके अपने साइट्स एक्सप्लेनेशन प्रोवाइड कर रहा है एवरी लॉ इन इंडिया हैज एन ऑफिशियल ट्रांसलेशन इन द रिस्पेक्टिव ऑफिशियल लैंग्वेज ऑफ एवरी स्टेट ओके तो अब देखो ऑथर एक जनरल स्टेटमेंट पे ऐसे दे रहा है कि कोई हर देखो हर लॉ का ट्रांसलेशन का तो इंग्लिश से उनके ऑफिशियल लैंग्वेज ऑफिशियल लैंग्वेज जो है हमारा इंग्लिश उससे हम जो भी स्टेट का लैंग्वेज है उसमें तो ट्रांसलेट करते हैं सारे लॉ को ओके सो द नीड फॉर द आईपीसी सीआरपीसी एंड एविडेंस एक्ट्स टू बी रेफर्ड टू इन इन देयर हिंदी नेम्स अलोन इज क्वेश्चनेबल ओके सो That's why the author is saying कि एक तो हम जो भी state से concerning है तो उसमें हम translate करते official language से उस state के language उस state की भाषा में हम translate तो करते ही हैं law को तो ये नया नाम for IPC, CRPC और evidence evidence act का नया नाम देना है is something that is questionable क्यों कर रहे हैं okay that means people will be questioning कि क्यों करना है okay the criminal Procedure law was reenacted in 1973 and it is known as the CRPC 1973 as distinct from its 1898 version. Okay, so this reenact was in 1973, which was CRPC and this new version was 1898. Okay, the objective to have Hindi names is apparently an attempt to symbolize the de-anglicization of the law, criminal law, okay? So, now, let's see, this is telling us what is the justification for it, that this is the purpose of doing this, and the purpose of doing this, and the purpose of doing this, is that all these Hindi names, that we have to use it with English, से रिलेशन रेलेवेंस उनका हटाएंगे ओके एलिमिनेट करेंगे ओके दैट इज़ द मकसद ओके हाउवेवर अ प्रेलिमिनरी स्क्रॉल थ्रू द न्यू लॉज इंडिकेट दैट मच ऑफ़ द ओरिजिनल लैंग्वेज इज़ रिटेन ओके लेकिन अगर आप आप उसका ये जो नया जो स्क्रॉल बन रहा है उसका उसका आप अगर प्रेलिमिनरी मतलब जो नया जो substance dekhoge to it is mostly in original language only okay just the name names have been changed content to original language just here ab dekho it raises a doubt whether the change are far too few to warrant their being enacted afresh as deletion and amendment may have achieved the same purpose okay to ye ye kya question hame kya raise karta or a question Okay, what is the next question that it raises? Okay, ये एक ऐसा doubt raise करता है कि okay, ये this it raises a doubt whether the changes are far too few to warrant their being enacted afresh. Okay, मतलब जो changes है उसमें ये doubt raise करता है कि ये जो changes हैं इसमें बहुत छोटे मोटे changes हैं बाकी language तो same ही है law का okay तो इसको वापस से a fresh start कर देना okay instead of इसको amendment की तरह use करना okay deletion या amendment करना क्या ये इससे क्या purpose solve होगा क्योंकि 
ठीक है सेम चीज तो कर सकते थे हम अमेंड करके ओके सो वाई इज इट बींग इनएक्टेड अ फ्रेश ओके क्यों एक नया इनएक्टमेंट uh, हो रहा है इसका टू स्टार्ट अ फ्रेश ओके it is some cons consolation that the the uh, are the, are to be scrutinized by the parliamentary standing committee as the consultation process appears inadequate okay तो अब इसमें थोड़ा सा relief factor क्या है कि इट इज सम कॉन्सोलेशन जो सानिताज है वो उनको स्क्रूटनाइज कर रहे हैं ओके आर ये जो सानिताज है उनको स्क्रूटनाइज किया जा रहा है किससे पार्लियामेंट्री स्टैंडिंग कमेटी इसको स्क्रूटनाइज कर रहे हैं एज द कंसल्टेशन प्रोपर्स प्रोसेस अपीयर्स इनएडिकुएट क्योंकि ये जो कंसल्टेशन प्रोसेस है ये बहुत इनएडिकुएट लग रहा है तो इसको वापस से ये जो सानिताज है इनको ये जो सानिताज है ओके सानिता 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 जो है इनको वापस से क्या किया जा रहा है पार्लियामेंट्री स्टैंडिंग कमेटी से वापस से इनको स्क्रूटनाइज uh, किया जा रहा है इन्वेस्टिगेट किया जा रहा है कि क्या जरूरी है कि नहीं ओके तो इफ इट इज एन इन कॉन्सोलेशन मतलब अगर ये थोड़ी सी भी सहानुभूति आपको प्रोवाइड कर रहा है तो बढ़िया है ओके नाउ मूविंग ऑन फर्दर इन सब्सटेंस अगर हम सब्सटेंस में देखें ओके द डिलीशन ऑफ सेडिशन इज वेलकम ओके अगर हम इसका सब्सटेंस देखें तो सेडिशन वर्ड जो है उसका डिलीट कर देना ये एक वेलकम है ठीक है ये दिस इज अ प्लस साइन ओके वाह वाह टाइप ओके दिस इज व्हाट दी ऑथर इज सेइंग कि अगर हम सब्सटेंस की बात करें ओके okay? कि क्या मैटर है इसमें तो सेडिशन को डिलीट कर दिया गया है वो वेलकम है एंड इट्स अपेरेंट इक्विवेलेंट द न्यू सेक्शन 150 डज नॉट यूज ओवरबोर्ड टर्म सच एज प्रोमोटिंग डिसअफेक्शन अगेंस्ट द गवर्नमेंट और ब्रिंगिंग इट इन इनटू हेट्रेट और कंटेम्प्ट ओके तो अब ये एग्जाम्पल दिया कि एक तो सेडिशन हटाया वो बहुत बढ़िया किया ओके और उसके बाद उसके इक्विवेलेंट और एक जो सेक्शन 150 है उसमें इन लोगों ने ज्यादा मतलब एक्सेसिवली टर्म्स ऐसे डिसअफेक्शन अगेंस्ट द गवर्नमेंट या ब्रिंगिंग इन टू हेट्रेट एंड कंटेम्प्ट ये सब हटा दिया है एक्सेसिव एक्सेसिव वर्ड्स को हटा दिया गया है और ओवरबोर्ड वर्ड्स को एग्जैजरेटिंग वर्ड्स को एक्साइटिंग वर्ड्स को हटा दिया गया ओके दीज आर गुड थिंग्स ओके दैट दी ऑथर इज पॉइंटिंग आउट एट ओके इट क्रिमिनलाइजेस फ्रॉम it criminalizes promoting secessionism separatism and armed rebellion but it also targets subversive activities and endangering the sovereignty unity and integrity of india terms that should not be allowed to be misused okay so this is why this is important that this is a good thing that they removed these things okay it is a good thing that they remove these things because ye kya promote karte hain secessionism promote karte hain okay kya promote karte hain secessionism promote karte hain separatism promote karte hain armed rebellion promote karte hain aur ye sab aur baki subversive activities promote karte hain jo sovereignty aur unity aur integrity of india ke liye अच्छा नहीं ओके इसका बहुत दुरुपयोग हो सकता है ओके देखो अनादर पोटेंशियली अनादर पोटेंशियली मिस यूजेबल प्रोविजन इज दैट इन द न्यू सेक्शन 195 इक्विवेलेंट टू सेक्शन 153 बी आईपीसी अब देखो यहां पर कोलन दिया गया है तो दैट मींस ये है जो नया मिस यूजेबल लॉ it penalizes uh, making or pub publishing false or misleading information jeopardizing the sovereignty unity and integrity of security of india okay ye ek again problematic cheez hai okay yahan par ek again problematic problematic cheez hai why while mob lynching and organized crimes are new sections a significant omission is hate speech even though defining it and uh, punishing it have been under discussion for some years okay to ab isme se mob lynching or organized crimes ye naya section mein add kar diya gaya hai okay lekin significant omission kis cheez ka kar diya gaya hai omit kisko kar diya gaya hata kisko diya gaya hate speech ko even after defining or punishing uh, or isko discussion mein rakhne ke bawajood इसको हटा दिया गया ओके सम बहुत टाइम से डिस्कशन में था फिर भी हटा दिया गया द प्रोसीजर कोड प्रोसीजर कोड इनेबल्स कॉन्डक्ट ऑफ ट्रायल ऑफ प्रोक्लेम्ड ऑफेंडर्स इन एबसेंशिया ओके तो ये जो प्रोसीजर कोड है ये क्या इनेबल करता है कॉन्डक्ट ऑफ ट्रायल ऑफ प्रोक्लेम ऑफ प्रोक्लेम्ड ऑफेंडर्स इन एबसेंशिया तो ये इनेबल करता है ऐसे कॉन्डक्ट ऑफ ट्रायल्स को जिसमें जो भी प्रोक्लेम्ड ऑफेंडर्स हैं 
उनके एब्सेंस में भी ये केस लड़ा जा सकता है केस आगे बढ़ा बढ़ाया जा सकता है ओके मेकिंग वीडियोग्राफी ऑफ सीजर्स मैंडेटरी इज वेलकम ओके अब ये देखो वीडियोग्राफी ऑफ सीजर्स ओके जितने भी सीजर्स uh, हुए हैं ओके okay? उनका वीडियोग्राफी को वेलकम कर दिया गया है ओके सो टू द प्रोविजन ऑफ फॉर डीम्ड सैंक्शन इफ अथॉरिटीज फेल टू ग्रांट इट विद इन वन ट्वेंटी डेज ओके सो एक्स्ट्रा डिटेल की अगर प्रोविजन सैंक्शन कर देता है तो अथॉरिटीज सॉरी अगर सैंक्शन कर सकते हैं अगर अथॉरिटीज उसको ग्रांट एक सौ बीस दिन में नहीं करते हाउ एवर द the remand provision seems to permit police custody beyond the current 15 days limit okay attaching some criticism okay attracting some criticism to so, uh, 15 din ka limit uh, se zyada kar de rahe hain uh, police ke custody mein rakhne ke liye to so, that is something that is again facing criticism okay the new law needs critical scrutiny but not new names okay so ab jo naya law hai usko crit क्रिटिकल इन्वेस्टिगेशन की जरूरत है ना कि नए 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 नाम की जरूरत है ओके सो दिस इज द एडिटोरियल ऑफ टुडे सो नाउ टेल मी नाउ टेल मी नाउ टेल मी नाउ टेल मी नाउ यू नो ऑल अलोंग ओके व्हाट इज द टोन स्केप्टिकल skeptical very important sabse zyada investigative ya skeptical okay scrutinizing skeptical investigative that will be uh, the one analytical ho sakta hai ओके एनालिटिकल हो सकता है क्योंकि ऑथर पॉजिटिव और नेगेटिव दोनों देख रहा है ओके इट इज नॉट द ऑथर इज नॉट हेवीली जस्ट क्रिटिसाइजिंग इट टॉकिंग अबाउट द पॉजिटिव्स आल्सो दैट हैव बीन इंक्लूडेड इन द थिंग तो या तो स्केप्टिकल होगा कि ये काम करेगा कि नहीं ये क्या ये इसकी क्या जरूरत थी उसकी क्या जरूरत थी एंड एनालिटिकल ओके दैट वुड बी दीज टू वुड बी द टोन ऑफ टूडे स्केप्टिकल एंड एनालिटिकल ओके डेफिनेटली मेरे को फिजिक्स मॉक टेस्ट चाहिए अन अकेडमी पे मिल सकता है अन अकेडमी पे पूछो भाई क्लैट में आज आप फिजिक्स मॉक बढ़िया 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 बहुत बढ़िया शानदार All right, so that is it for today. बहुत ज़्यादा time extend हो गया. Thank you so much for having the patience, all of you all, and thank you so much for attending the session. I will see you again in the next session. That is at four the warriors and six pm. Do not forget, आज हमारा vocabulary mega quiz है of one hour. All right, of all the words that we have discussed from starting from fifth of uh, August till the eleventh of August. Okay, fifth से eleventh August तक का है. Please पढ़ लेना. And this time the word meanings you will have to remember because all the words will be jumbled up. That's it. All right. Thank you, Yashi. Hi, Yashi. Again, okay, bye, Yashi. Uh, thank you so much. Yes. फिजिक्स फिजिकल बोल रहा है वो फिजिकल नोट मिल सकता है आपको सब्सक्राइब करना पड़ेगा आपको uh, अगर आप किसी आइकॉनिक uh, आप आइकॉनिक का सब्सक्रिप्शन लेते हो तो आपको फिजिकल नोट्स मिल जाएंगे ऑल राइट बाय बाय एक्सोटिक बॉय क्रिस्टी बाय चूस मोरिवंशी बाय और वन एंड श्रेया बाय यशी बाय आज अल्पेश नहीं आया noted bye bye thank you vedika dal